In this video, I will explain how you can embed Google AdSense ads in your website, especially the React and Next.js application. So there are two types of ads, auto and manual ads. First of all, I will show you how you can embed the auto ads and after that I will jump onto the manual ads as well. To embed the auto ads in your website, what you have to do is that there are two steps. First is that you have to go to your Google AdSense account and then turn on the auto ads. So if I go to my account, you can see that I am in the ad section and over here it is showing all the websites that I have got. You can see that this auto ads is turned on. In case it is off for you, you can click on this button and then turn it on. Okay. Once that is done, next step is very simple. Just copy this code. Okay. This one and you have to put it in the head section of your application. So in next is 13 there is layout.tsx file where generally you have got the head section. So this file is uh, in the app directory you can see here. So just go there and then paste that script code that we just uh, copied. So here you have to just copy that uh, code script code that we just copied and make sure that this particular script code is added only when you are running the application in the production. Okay this is how you can do that process.env.node underscore env is equal to production. That's it. And then automatic ads will be shown. Now how the ads are going to be shown depends upon the settings. So if you go here in this button. So basically over here it will show you the preview like how the ads will be shown on your website. And right side there is a settings that you can control. For example on some pages you don't want to show the ads. You can exclude those pages by going here. If you want to exclude the ads in certain areas, you can click here in the excluded area section. And also you can uh, disable some ads as well, like overlay formats, in page formats, those kinds of ads. So on the left hand side, you can see that it is showing how the ads will be shown on your website. You can see it in the mobile view as well as desktop view as well. That's it. So this is how you can embed the auto ads in your Next.js or React applications. Now next type of ad is manual ad. So let us see how to add the manual ads in your Next.js or React application. So th that process is a little bit uh, difficult. So for that you have to go here in the buy ad unit and then create the unit by clicking here and then you can select type horizontal square vertical give the name to the ad select the responsive ad size and then click on create. So basically it will create the ad unit and it will be shown over here. Once that is done just click here to copy the code that you want to insert in your application. Basically this is good for the traditional applications but since you're using the React or the Next.js this is not gonna work. So if you just copy and paste it into your React component this is not gonna work because it will not understand this script tag then this ins. So you need to convert this code into a React code. So for that I have got one example over here. So basically uh, what I'm doing here is that I'm using this use path name use search params which detects the change in the URL and also make sure that uh, you're using the use client because this is a client component. And over here if it is development I don't have to do anything otherwise what will happen is that it will render this component basically this is the element ins that is provided by the Google and what we want to do is that once this particular component is mounted we want to execute this code ads by Google dot push so basically this statement is gonna create the ad and display on the page but what happens is that uh, this particular script that you see over here has to be loaded asynchronously and sometimes that script is not loaded and executed and that's why we have got the sales condition so basically it is going to add the event listener on that script so once that script is loaded we are calling this handle script load so this function and then window dot adds by google this will be available for us and then adds by google dot push we can call that and then add will be displayed that's it that's how we can add the manual as well as the auto ads in uh, your react or nexus application thank you for